One woman is dead after a crash in Miami County. Authorities tell us it happened around 10:30 in Ludlow Falls. Investigators say they're getting conflicting stories from the two drivers involved. Two News reporter Jake Ryle is live with the new overnight details. Well, Brooke, we know it was a 64-year-old woman, Deborah K. Ritter, who died at the scene in Wednesday night's crash. That being confirmed with the Miami County Sheriff's Office. The driver of one of those cars, Ritter's fiance, David Pope, was taken here behind me to Miami Valley Hospital with non-life-threatening injuries. And we know this happened in Ludlow Falls right around 1030. Deputies tell us a vehicle was turning from Markley Road to Range Line Road when it was hit by a van. In the other car, there were two teenagers. Neither of them were hurt. All four people involved were wearing seatbelts, according to the sheriff's office. Right now, investigators are piecing together the accident reconstruction to, to determine who was at fault. Now, this accident happened right at the beginning of the 100 deadliest days for teenage drivers. Now, according to AAA, more than 1,000 deadly accidents in the next 100 days could involve teenage drivers nationwide. Right now, we want to make sure that you know there is no word yet on who exactly was at fault for this crash, as the sheriff's office is receiving uh, conflicting reports from both drivers. Now, at last check, the driver of the vehicle, the car, was taken here to Miami Valley Hospital with non life threatening injuries. We're going to continue to monitor that uh, all morning long and provide updates on WDTN.com. For now, reporting live in Dayton, Jake Ryle, 2 News Today, working for you.